Anna, I'm back and this week I'm doing some different ways just to entertain yourself when you're bored. Um, the first one, I found this in my old Reckless journal. It was sort of like infinite line. Um, it's just something you can do if you don't want to concentrate or if you're like watching something but you, you need something else to do, I don't know. Um, yeah, it's really simple and I think it looks cute. But um, yeah, yeah. You can do this with pretty much anything. You could do it the other way around. You could have it inside the letters. You could do it like with a picture. Um, it would look nice if you wanted to make like cards or something or like a poster. Um, I don't know. It's just a quick little way. Like if you're ever bored, it makes a nice little picture and it looks cute once you're done. And you can just do anything. Like it takes no skill or concentration at all. And yeah, that was number one. Um, the second thing, I know I put this is works with, but it does work with nearly anything. Um, basically just outline the shape you want and then do some straight lines around everything but the shape. Um, little tip, I used fine liners for this and it took so long. So if you do it, it does look better with fine liners, it really does, but this took about half an hour just to do the lines I got to the bottom and then I thought nah and I just cut the bottom of the paper off but if you were like just doodling this is also good for like posters and cards and stuff and you can do like pictures like this it does work with actually anything um, and obviously I did blue and pink for this one and it looks cute with the two colours and then you can see there on the three that it does look really like effective once it's finished. Um, I also did like a quick hand just to show you it in a thicker pen one colour with like not writing so you could see what that looks like and with the hand obviously the lines weren't like particularly good because it's such a big shape and it's such a thick pen but I still think it works really well even if like the lines aren't perfect so it, you don't need to be particularly good at it, drawn to do this it, I think that they both look really good and number three I just I did this I don't know why I did this but I did the same drawing with my left hand and my right hand because I'm left handed but um I think it's just fun because it, it sort of like shows you how good a drawing you are whenever you're like oh I can't draw because in comparison with the hand you don't draw with you're pretty damn good at drawing like even if you think you're terrible, in comparison with the other hand, you're like Picasso. So yeah, um, and I just wanted to draw a skull, really. I really like drawing skulls. It's like the one thing that I don't need any reference for. I can just like draw a skull. But yeah, <laughs> um, so I just wanted to do that. And I was doodling with my right hand like the other day and I thought, yeah, let's do that. Um, didn't turn out too well though it, with my right hand. My left hand looks cute but it cuts out and there we go because my camera ran out. Um, so yeah and then I do the same with the right hand and wow it's just it's so hard to draw with the hand that like you're not used to like it was really hard not to just give the pen to my left hand and like continue with that because I could see like me doing the wrong lines and it was so frustrating but at the end you do think wow maybe I am better at drawing than I think um, and it's just fun to be like look what I can do with my right hand that's weird um, I often think like what if I'd started writing with my right hand when I was younger would I be able to draw I think that's a really weird thing to think about but um, yeah these are three ways where you can just sort of kill time if you're bored and draw things that don't take too much concentration and um, that's just the comparison shot as you can see the green was better um, but yeah feel free to give it a thumbs up if you like this video and watch some of my other videos and try these drawings yourself I would like to see some of them if you do any just let us know and I'll see you next week